Vancouver Point Grey. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. More than 40 years ago, an innovative new medical clinic opened. Operating out of a 10 by 20 foot trailer, the Pine Free Clinic was a Vancouver first in providing free, confidential care for young people. Since that remarkable start decades ago, the clinic hasn't slowed down. They're now based on West 4th Avenue, and they become Kitsilano's public health care heart, six days a week, all day and after regular working hours. Three regular nurses, two front desk staff, a counselor, and a rotating team of part-time doctors, all with a special interest in working with youth, call the clinic home. They take their youth-centered mandate very seriously. Youth have enough to worry about with their health issues without worrying about being judged by a room full of other people, said a former nurse. The employees at the clinic are paid on salary, giving them the chance to spend extra time with scared, confused young people who are looking for medical and sometimes life assistance. Youth from all over the Lower Mainland come for over 12,000 clinic visits each year. While keeping young people at the centre of everything they do, this clinic has also taken the free in its name literally, expanding its mandate to serve those left out of our healthcare system. For example, the Pine Free Clinic offers, of course, free services to refugees not covered by MSP. In fact, anyone who doesn't have an MSP card or insurance can come in for treatment. By providing care for those that nobody else will, the clinic fills an essential public health niche in preventing the transmission of infections and diseases that would otherwise go untreated and undiagnosed. The recent announcement that this decades-old clinic will close has been met with shock and disbelief. Countless former patients have shared stories about how Pine provided them with knowledge and care that they desperately needed as young people. Former staff were baffled that such a fixture of public health in Lower Mainland could be seen as a cost liability instead of a cost saver. Working together, we can save the Pine Free Clinic because although it has been 40 years, it is just as innovative and essential now as it was when it first opened in 1972.